All right, this is like my fourth time recording this. What's going on, everybody? Boy Jim Beck, and today we're going in the RU tier. This is a team that I made. Not very um, polished up. Have to, you know, polish out the details. But um, it's working pretty good so far. I really want to fit in a steel type so that I can take um, rock moves and normal moves because at the moment I'm really only in frostless and frostless. I really don't want to take hits with that much. Um, and boards on his team, which is very, very annoying. His team has one hair cross switch in, which is the palace sand for its stab. Close combat two, it kills everything on his team. And hair cross, does it outspeed lichen rock? How do I midnight? It may out. It does. It does outspeed his like rock on eighty-five speed. I could lead out with the frost last to get up spikes, but he does have these two Pokemon which have well against it and the Embor. I I guess he may just lead out with the like rock, and I think it has sturdy or something. Well, it's, I guess they run Sash. I'm going to Blastoise doesn't seem too bad of a lead. He does lead out with this and. I don't really have good options. If he's like nasty plus bad, but I don't think he is. He has to fake out. Why is this? Good lord. Alright, this is fine. It's fake out, so it's not nasty plot. Okay, the toxic is really bad though. The toxic is pretty bad. But I do get the burn, which is very, very nice for me. I'm going to. I really want to scald again. But the Toxin is going to rack up, and I'm going to probably have to switch out next turn anyway. And the Scald on a Blastoise or a Drampa is not really worth it. So what I'm going to do here, I really want to switch. What do I switch to though? I don't want the Embor to come in because this is poisoned and it puts a lot of pressure on this. So the best bet for Ember to not come in is to not go to Frostlast or Shaman. However, if he does go Ember and I go Shaman, I can Earth Power it. I don't really need Shaman. So I'm going to go down to Shaman so that if he does go Ember, it's going to kill itself. Uh, I forgot about Parting Shot. I was just thinking of U-Turn. But Parting Shot is um, the go-to move on Persian. I'm going to make sure that uh, Earth Power plus Recoil kills him with the Ember. Because it, it should. should. This is a Scarf Shaman. Uh, what is it called? Embor? So, a minus one. Is Psychic Earth part of the same power? I think they are. So, it's going to do 56. No, it's not. It's going to 43 to 50. So. I don't want to switch out to Moltres. Moltres is actually very important because it can toxic this and it can handle the Drampa. But this also handles. No, that's fine. I'm just going to Earth Power here. Because. Okay. That's the reason why I didn't want to go with the Moltres. He has no. He has switches to this, but they're not good switches. So I'm just going to Earth Power again. That was a crit. Oh my god. Does this get rock moves? I know it's it's a special attacker, so I don't really care if he gets rock moves on a special. I'm just gonna go Moltres here. Um, the fact that it's weakened this much. How much does a wild charge do to Shaman? How much should a wild charge do? 16 to 19 sc scarfed. So I did 17. So this thing is scarfed. I don't think it kills my Moltres if it's Scarfed. Yeah. So Flamethrower should knock this out here. Actually, it doesn't. That's depressing. Oh well. I'm gonna go out to my thing now and. It should be fine. I really need to tax something on this team so that uh, I can put more pressure on this team. Tax is just very, very good because he has a pretty slow team. He makes a smart double here. Um. 
don't want to go to Blastoise because I don't want toxic damage to rack up. I do still want the Blastoise to roar stuff away. I guess this isn't really that important. So I'm going to go to this. I could taunt this. I'm probably going to be going out. I probably won't outspeed because it's max HP, max speed, just like I am. Just like me. Alright, that's pretty cool. It goes for the Z parting shot so that the Emperor is uh, now back up to full. But uh, that's fine. He used up his Z move, which isn't really that important. I'm going to go to. I'm gonna go blast this here. Yeah, it'll take that really well. And. I'm gonna go double to Shaman in case he wants to go to his own Blastoise. Nice. So, his Seed Flare switch ins are Drampa and Embor. He knows that I'm Scarf though, so he could go to. Is Drampa Sap Sipper? It could be Sap Sipper, but I wanna put pressure on this anyway. Alright, I knock it out, so now I can set up more spikes later on. Which is nice. Alright, um. Let me think here. Do I need Blastoise now? Well, I guess Shaman actually becomes so much better despite killing the main threat because like Earth Power with Spikes up is just so good with Blastoise gone. I just need more damage on Drampa so that Earth Power does... I guess Earth Power is the main move that I'm going against Drampa anyway so like let's think about Dazzle Gleam. Dazzle Gleam is really nice against this team now. I guess I don't need Blastoise. But it's not like I'm stacking Blastoise anyway. So the Embor's 100% in range of Earth Power with Rocks Up through Parting Shot. So that's pretty good. Alright, this is really nice. I can Ice Beam this. And yeah, Earth Power puts in a lot of work with this Ice Beamed. I'm putting myself in a solid position. Uh, this thing, I gotta keep in mind, this thing is Scarfed. Special attack rose, goes for Thunderbolt, nice. So here, I can go for Ice Beam, but I don't know if Ice Beam is going to knock it out because this has more special attack than this, but this is Stab. I don't think it does that much more damage. I'm going to go out to this. I can Pursuit here. I'm going to just close combat. I actually don't know if Knockoff can knock this out. I think it will. But whatever, I'm just gonna click close combat because I don't think you can risk me clicking knockoff. If Embor comes in here, he's gonna be in Earth Power range of Shaman through Parting Shot, like I said earlier. Because he's gonna. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Uh, this is fine. What's he gonna do? Is he gonna ground or ghost? If he grounds. If he goes, it's ghost, right, every time. Because these two are worse than the ground that's super protected, so. He's gonna go for the ghost move here. I guess Moltres is not useful anymore. It is a fire resist, but that's fine. It is toxic resist. This is kind of annoying. I don't really want to go for Roost because then he just hits me super effective. Oh my god. Is this. This feels like weakness policy or Pasha Berry. Uh, that's unfortunate crit on for me. I'm gonna risk here. Cause the Earth Power is gonna do 52. And if he does click Earth Power, like he also has to click Shore up at the same time, so. Yeah. So now I believe that's in range of Flamethrower. Yeah, I did a great crit last time, but. That's fine. I could risk here. Alright, so this is solid. I'm in a solid position. I have speed on Shaman, so yeah, I think Earth Power wins me the game. I think Light can rock dice to Earth Power. I'll just act this. I don't want him to sort his answer something. I know he gets Sucker Punch, I think. Oh, this is this is bulky. I'll stack for Ocelus. 
nice disable. Nice disable. Guess I'll pursue here. <laughs> solid, 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 solid. Predicted, predicted the uh, the close combat to not Oko there. So, pursued damage enables me to Oko this with Shaman. Perfect, perfect play on my part. Perfect play. I don't really know. Like, if I calc this, if I calc this game, this was very, very easily won. But, uh, unfortunately for me, I'm not going to calc everything. The Ember calc is very important, though, so I had to do that. I can rock Midnight versus a Shaman. Earth power does 44 to 52, so... Oh my god, Yanni Ishuka. That was a genius play on my part. <sighs> genius play on my part. Earth power should knock this out because... This is, uh, this thing doesn't have the greatest spit F. Alright. We're gonna set up a little bit more so that the uh, Earth Power does more damage to the Persian. Let me, let me see here. It was faster than my guy, so it's, it can't be spit F. It was faster than my Frost last. So it had to be max speed. Well, not max speed, but near max speed. But I'm gonna just assume that it is max speed. Alright, cool. Are you's pretty fun? I like you a little bit more, but are you's pretty fun? <sighs> this is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough. He has a Dragalgy. And the cool thing about Sharpedo is that I can burn it with Flame Body. And that's the only thing about Sharpedo. Um, another Embor. I feel like Cell Target is really, really solid against this team, so I'm gonna just lead out with Mesprit. Hopefully, he doesn't lead out with Sharpedo. The Dub Blade is easily handled. Uh, the thing is, he has a. Okay, so he's gonna lead out with his stealth rock user. Um, do I want this thing to get weakened? If this thing gets weakened, then I don't have anything to take a Dragology on. So I think I'm going to Ice Beam here. Oh, I, should, I meant to click U-turn, I think, because I don't want to get toxic. What did he do? He Earth Powered this? I'm going to U-turn here. I should have U-turned here last time. I don't really care about hair cross taking damage. Okay, dude. What do I do here? Do I knock off or do I pursuit? I'm gonna just. Or I have Megahorn. I'm gonna knock off. Frost is really annoying to deal with. I mean, Wimsicott is really annoying to deal with. Hopefully, he doesn't U turn. He did U turn. Skull does around 40% double blade, so I'm not too concerned if he does go Sharpedo. Oh my god, this is so bad. He's not gonna. Oh, he might crunch here actually. Oh, this is so bad. I don't get the spin. Is crunch killing? Crunch is killing, right? Oh my goodness. I think I have to get flame body here. Oh, the drop was so bad. Am I dead? I'm dead to the next one. Uh, that sucks. He played it really weird. Why did he, um, Earth Power? Oh well. Alright, so... I feel like there should probably be Culver Berry, now that I think about it. There should probably be Culver Berry. I'm gonna start to the Moltres here. Maybe got a Flame Body. Okay, Banded. What is this week to? Ghost? Four times? I don't need uh, my... I don't need my ban on this, but that's fine. I can Stealth Rock here, nice. South Arc is solid. He goes back out to Pangoro. I'm gonna get turned back into the Moltres. Hopefully get a burn this time. No burn, no burn. That's fine. Alright. He's probably gonna go Glide Score here. So. I gotta double switch out to Mesprit. He's 100% banned because I'm a defensive Moltres. 
Uh, if he knocks off here, that's a good play. Hopefully he didn't knock off. If I spike here, and he goes out to Pangora, that's fine. I'm gonna spike. So I can go to Heracross. Heracross resists this, so that's fine. It's not too bad. I gotta double here. I gotta put pressure on the glass score. I could I could taunt this. I think I'm gonna taunt this. Nice, nice, nice. Um, I can start roaring. I don't think anything the ass hit me with is going to do a lot of damage. So I'm gonna spike here. Nice, nice, nice. I don't think Ice Beam is gonna two hit kill the Pangoro with hazards up. And this is this is my spike user, so it's a little it's gonna be a little bit annoying. But Heracross is gonna take another knockoff, so I'm gonna ice beam here. I could have doubled into Heracross, but then I was forced to make Oh. Well that helps a lot. Um I think Ice Beam kills because of that. Just gonna make sure though. Ice Beam does 36 to 42. Let's just make this a crit. Uh, I don't have attack. Ice Beam with a crit does 40 to 48 with no attack. So it's not max HP. 27 to 30. So yeah, this is a kill, unfortunately for him. Um, 27 to 32. So there was no chance that was killing. So that's unfortunate for him. This is going to kill me. Let's see here. Ah. Uh, what do I need? The hair cross I need for the for the reuniclus, huh? What do I need this for? I need this to pressure his I need to taunt the floor guess and I need to ice beam the Gligar. But with spikes up, like it's only really hitting these two Pokemon, Stealth Rock is this, but this is already going to die to whatever. It's going to be boom burst, obviously, because it's scrappy. Let's calc swallow versus my Mesprit. I'm not max but F. And 303. Oh, that's gonna do a ton. Boomers is 51 to 60, and that's yeah. What do I need Blastoise for? Roaring. The Arena Cliss. Does Shaman kill it? Shaman Sea Flare to 69 to 70. Let's go, Shaman. And Dazzle. Yeah, Sea Flare does more, right? 180, 90. Does this have bulk or something? What the heck? That did nothing. It said C flare to 69 to oh I did calc life orb, I calc life orb. Alright. Got a psychic here. Try to do as much damage to the Forgus as possible. If it goes Gligar, yeah, it's gonna die, so it's fine. If this thing goes down, it's fine. Um unfortunately the Needle King is the next threat that I have to worry about. Actually, I don't know how I beat the Florgus to be honest. I have to like I don't know how to beat the floor used to be honest. Yeah, I don't know. Cause I don't know how I'm gonna keep up hazards. I guess a Gligar. The Gligar doesn't Gligar the Gligar doesn't have speed Blastoise, does it? Blastoise is like 86. Oh Blastoise 78, Blastoise 78. Is this Trick Room? No. Nice. That's pretty good. Even if he has Thunderbolt. If he has Thunderbolt, it's slightly annoying, but yeah. So now I can't take a Moonblast. Or a Psy Shock. What 
What is this? Wait, what? Oh shoot, I put speed I put speed on my blastoise, I forgot about it. I put speed on my blastoise. So now this fellow's dead. Now he goes out to Rainy Clist and he's gonna Psy Shock me. Alright, what do I do against Psy Shock? I guess I just go for Rosslust, right? Because I can Mega Horn that. Ah. I don't know, man. Because what do I do against the Florgus? I have to Thunder Wave? I have to keep roaring against it, but this is not going to take roars. I gotta go to this. Oh, nice. Psy Shock has been disabled. So I go Heracross here? Because if I Thunder Wave this... Heracross beats this anyway, so I gotta go Heracross here. Okay. He doesn't have Shadow Ball, he has Focus Blast. Calm Mind. I gotta knock this off. I gotta just let this thing die. Alright, this is where you turn. Solid, solid, solid. So now he has to Moonblast. Hopefully it does knock me out. Alright, so I lose. Ah, do I lose this game? I don't lose it just yet because Thunder Wave is a move. This is slightly more annoying. I gotta freeze this. <laughs> this is at 100% though. I gotta freeze. It's the only way. He's gonna wish here, right? No wish, okay. I still don't have a chance, I don't think. Moonblast does just kills me. It did 60 last time. Yeah. GG. Oh, I think the play... The only play that I had was to go to Frostlass and disable disable his Moonblast. That was the only play I had. How did Moltres die? Moltres died to Pangoro, right? That was the Pangoro dude? Yeah. Was that the Pangoro dude? I don't know. I don't remember. Moonblast did way too much damage. It was Pangoro because I had to pressure his team with Frostlass. Okay. Mama Blood. Dolphin is lowly annoying. Ah, uh, he had Thunderbolt too on the... I guess I could have played around the Thunderbolt a little bit better. I'm really out of Frostlass. At least I'll heal it solid. Incineroar, I have... Blastoise and Moltres for solid, 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 solid. Uh, I guess I'll just go Shaman here. No, 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 no. Probably Mesprit, right? Because this, this he has to only Hyper Voice now. He can't click Hyper Voice, so he's gonna Volt Switch here. I go Shaman or Mesprit, and I don't know what he goes out into on Mesprit. I guess Incineroar. Oh, it just goes in center anyway. I'm gonna go Moltres here. Back to Heelisk. So, why didn't he Volt Switch? Did he not want to take damage? I don't have a ground type. Yeah, he Volt Switches here. I don't understand why. He Volt Switched there, not on the Frost last. I guess he didn't want to, did not want to take more damage. Alright, so this thing is probably scarfed. I don't know. Incineroar. Shaman. This should die to Earth Power. Fifty-four to sixty-four. Not quite. Goes for U-turn again. Wow. He probably goes Dawnfan here because he's tired of the hazards, which is fine. Because I can then go Mesprit on that. Ah, can I? 
Because Blessed is pressured by a lot of things on his team. Oh my god, what is he doing? Hyper voice? Yeah, okay. He's gotta stay in here, yep. Nice, nice, nice. So, Incinero is an Earth Power range. And everything on his team doesn't want to take an Earth Power outside of Roserade and Como. So, that's pretty good. Getting rid of this is pretty big. Stealth Rock up is the next step, so then Incinero dies to a lot of things on my team. <laughs> Alright, Moltres is a lot less pressure too, which is nice. I'm just gonna go hair cross here, dude. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. He can ice shard here, but that means I can get a stealth rock. And if he doesn't get a stealth rock, then he's... Alright, nice, nice, nice. Rose Raid, are you going down to speed me? Oh, that would be pretty bad if it does. I'll go Mesprit. Mesprit seems solid. Oh, you turn. I'll you turn with Mesprit into probably Frostless. Nope, no Frostless needed. What does Scarf Incinera run? Does it run a rock move? I really want to go Moltres the U turn because. He can't really stay into fire. It's got to run fire, dark. It probably runs rock, right? I can healing wish nothing. Got earth power. All right, so that thing's gone. I'll ice beam this. I can't roar in case he's soundproof. Plus two outrage. Oh my goodness! Don't kill me. Oh, it's not even outrage. Is that GG? I couldn't have roared because if, if he was soundproof, that was bad. But I could have went frostless. I could have went frostless. Forced him to attack. Go out to shaman and dazzle. This thing cannot take an outrage. It's plus two. Maybe he burns? I gotta disable it now then. I got so many 30%. Gotta, gotta work in my favor. Nice. Uh, it's unfortunate. He, uh... Uh, that's fine, I think. What are you dragging this on? Shame on Earth Power. Alright, so that's pretty solid. Vaporeon. Skull will kill Heracross. Skull will kill Shaman. Will Skull kill Shaman actually? I think I want a healing wish the hair across. But at that point I got a close combat. I'm way too low now. Like Psychic's not gonna kill the Roserade. And the Roserade will probably kill me after Skull damage on this. So I gotta stay in here. Actually, let's, let's just see if, um, the opponent kills me with Scald here. Let's just see. Let's just see it. Oh my god, it wasn't even close. It wasn't even freaking close. Alright, solid. 
but I guess it really doesn't matter because I was going to go for this play anyway. See if you're fast. He is fast. Alright. <sighs> Maybe he was scarfed. Which is why he went for Giga Drain. And has the fact that he has extra sensory on his Roserade. Because if you want to catch Heracross, you just range you fire. Alright. Stealth Rock is so good. Uh, I guess I feel like I really need a ground type too now. I think about it because like I'm, I keep facing these electric types that are really really solid. All right, that's fine. I assume he's not going to kill this, and he's gonna. Do a ton of damage with thunder, but nice. He gets paralyzed. Or whatever this is. Curse bodied. He's not gonna go big barrel, right? He's not gonna go teplosion. Oh, he might go teplosion. No, no, what am I just saying? He doesn't go these two, these three. But he might go big barrel or teplosion. I gotta go shame in here. Z yawn. Oh, this is perfect. Um, is he faster than me? <laughs> it has to be faster than me. I don't know why he went for Z on against something that has natural cure, but whatever. If he goes to Flourish, I'm gonna go hard into Blast Fist and click Roar. And hopefully I can get a Rob Spin off on a Tyrantrum switching or something. Actually, I don't really need Rob Spin. Oh, is this GG? If I go hair cross, hair cross doesn't do anything. <sighs> That's a, that sucks around. Why is this so slow? Max HP, max attack. Well, I'm not gonna let you get the spin off. No anchor shot. I could knock off. I think that'll kill. Or I could pursuit. Knock off or pursuit. Pursuit's the better play. Like, he, Gamma Show is definitely the play you should make here because it's not going to do anything. Let me, let me think here. If I knock off and get a kill, then this thing, this thing is 100% going to be a 50% for the rest of the game. Because he cannot spin here. And I'm a shaman. The only problem is the Nido Queen. The Nido Queen is not a problem at all. I'm going to pursue here. <sighs> it's fine. I'm going to pursue here, obviously. Uh, Blastoise can probably just win the game against Nido Queen, uh, Typhlosion, and Galvangelo. It was out to Typhlosion hard. Um, I feel like I gotta preserve, so I gotta go Moltres here. Because it loses to the Nido Queen anyway. Goes for the Eruption. I don't think you can have Flash Fire with Eruption. Whatever. I think Toxic is a better play anyway. Or I could U turn. Oh, U turn. Darn. Alright, so I've got Eruption a little bit, <laughs> which is uh, alright. I want to be able to outspeed his Nita Queen, so with my hair across, so I'm gonna rise spin here. He goes actually out into it raw, which is nice, because now I can scald, get some damage off, and ensure that Earth Power kills. He goes for rocks. Let me think here. Do I need a rise spin or do I sh should I just knock this out? Because Earth Power knocks out the Galvantula. I'll just scald. Because I rise spin. Honestly, the thing is, if I rise spin. Spun. If I rouse spun, then he would have probably went for rocks again. I would be a little bit healthier. So maybe that was a play. Oh well. He's gonna thunder here, and then I go to shaman. Let's think here. I'll just like Moltres. Or 
Power has to kill this. Earth Power will kill this. Oh, come on. Oh, sick, he choked. Well, I guess he didn't know I scarfed. But this is nice. Because now Blastus wins. Would Bug Buzz have even killed me? I don't even know if it would have. Because it, it lived the... Uh, I live that hit. He wants a speed time, must be nice. Oh well, he Arashi doesn't do nearly as much damage. Well, he could crit me, which is, you know, wonderful. Solid. Ah, crit wouldn't have killed. Alright. One through three through seven. Solid, solid, solid. I don't know if I'm loud enough. I don't know if you guys can actually hear me that well. I'm gonna have to turn my way, my guy, myself all the way up. I'm all the way up. The Bane, my Bane, and then he has the Gudra too. I don't know, man. Yeah, I feel like the Moltres, the Moltres is not a weak link to the team, but because of my other Pokemon on the team, I can't really take advantage of Moltres. This is, this is annoying. I'm gonna lead up Moltres though. He leads out Frost Slash, I'm gonna just land Thor. Like, I got Rive Spin, so I can Rive Spin on Florgus, this, maybe not the Espeon, but definitely the Hitmon top, so. Shouldn't be too bad, shouldn't be too bad. Okay, I'm gonna annoy this dude. Okay, solid. What's he gonna do here? I'm just gonna Toxic. He probably has, um... No, I'm not gonna reveal Toxic. I'm gonna just U-turn. If he's Calm Mind, that's... Problematic. Calm Mind, Wish... Moon Blast. That would be awful, but usually on a team like this, it's not gonna be Calm Mind. And all that garbage. He might go into Drippy on here. Let's see, is Stealth Talk really that important? Or should I just get up Momentum? Stealth are really that important. Actually, it's fine. I can Stealth Rock, and if he goes Drake Beyond, I can go hard into Heracross. If he wants to set a Toxic Blaze. I could also go Blastus, but like, Blastus really. Like, Toxic Spikes are not that big of a deal, because it actually benefits my Heracross. Oh, shoot. Does this get a Psychic move? This is. Please, 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 please. Ah, uh, wait, that died? I died? That's crazy. Alright, solid, solid, solid. I'm gonna toxic this 100%. This is really annoying. And Thunderbolt shouldn't do too much yet. Oh my god. <sighs> That's so lame. That's super lame. I really want to spike, but I can't afford to do that. I don't want the Hitmontop coming in here, and I don't want this thing taking damage, so I'm gonna do this play. Nice, nice, nice. Don't want him to taunt or toxic. Solid, solid, solid. Oh, he might go. He, nobody goes SP on here. Sick, sick, sick. Are you serious? <sighs> he knows my moveset, so he has to go SP on here, right? <sighs> I 
I could roar to go force him into a random Pokemon. But then he gets up his last layer of spike. I'm a roar. He might think that he outspeeds me, which would be nice. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, I still don't see how I beat the Florgus because this is so low. I have Taunt here, but like I said, it's, it's so low. I go with Mesprit here. I can't let this take any more damage because I needed to take a Moonblast. Aw, oh, this is nice. This is nice. Because now Ice Beam kills that. Does he know I'm Leftovers? I think he does. I don't know if he knows I'm leftovers. I revealed taunt. I don't know why you're going to this. This is very good for me. Stream here. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> Moltres is so bad. But I have to do it. Oh, nice. Nice, 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 nice. So, I got a thunder wave of this. I should have taunted. I should have taunted. What was I doing? What was I doing? It obviously has nothing to hit me with. And if you foresighted, that was so bad. That was so bad. What am I thunder waving this for? That was such a bad play. I'm lucky I didn't get punished. Very, very lucky I didn't get punished on that play. So he actually cannot come in again with this. So I don't know what he's trying to pull. I don't want this thing to die. But I, f I have to do this. He can spin. If I ice beam and he spins, then he can come in on Moltres. He can come in on Mesprey, he can come in on Blastoise. I'm gonna go to Moltres here. And I'm gonna go Mesprit here in case he wants to go to hit my top. And in case he wants to struggle as well. Can't let him spin because I need to kill the Florigus. Alright, solid. He did get off that hit, but I'm not letting him spin. Not letting this thing spin. Shaman is the only play. I think I have to Earth Power. So I hit this super. I got a Dazzle. I got a Dazzle. I got a Dazzle. So now he goes into Drapion. Can't kill me with anything. Moltres is the play. So now I can earth power this. He's gotta have three attacks, source has three attacks, there's no way. Alright, cool, cool. I lucked out that game, man. Like Frostless wouldn't have been alive for so long and the hit on top probably would have been able to spin. Florgus would have stayed alive. 
and I wouldn't have had hazards to win me this game because I needed hazards to kill the Florgist and the Drapion probably last game last game Yeah, the shaman, the shaman needs to go on this mess I need, I need, I need a steel type, and I probably need a ground type. And you still have probably need a ground type. Does hair curls even work that well with spikes? I don't know if it does. I don't know if it does. Alright, he has this. I have, he has this. So I like, I have to go hard shaman every time. I think. With Stealth Rock up, this is solid because his Dazzling Gleam Resist is Rotom. And if I Dazzle, that takes 25. So that's fine. TM101 Voltern. Hold on. What is the Volt Switch TM? TM72. U turn TM. If the U turn TM is 29, if U turn TM is 29, what TM is U turn? TM is 89. U turn is TM 89. I don't know why it's TM 101. Like, I. Leech Light doesn't do much. Well, it does, it does a lot, but it doesn't do, you know infinite <sighs> let me s just megahorn kill hopefully megahorn kills I have nothing else to take a liquid Sick life. Sick life. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? What's you, what you gonna do, dude? What you gonna do? Return? That's a two-hit KO? That's stupid. He's gonna tag again, though. I know you, bro. I know you're kind. Are you freaking- Are you serious? I think Megahorn would have done at least 75 to the Rock would did. Don't stand. Do not stand. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What does Shaman do? It doesn't do anything. I have to use this as a spin block. <sighs> Blast let's go. I can't even freeze this. Is he gonna leech life or is he gonna liquidate? I wanna say this as a sack. I really wanna go to Shaman. What? Why did you aqua ring? Why would you aqua ring? Hold on, do I even need the hazards? I need the hazards because of the Araquanid. I need to do damage to the Araquanid. I gotta go frost last year. And then I gotta go shaman.
his flamethrower, so I don't need to worry about him being scarfed or whatever. Not scarfed, uh, Dragon Dance, Dragon Dance. <sighs> Should I have just one for close combat? Let me count how much close combat would have done to the Rockwood, dude. Oh, nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna taunt. Did I taunt? I don't know if I taunt. Oh, sick taunt, sick taunt on my part, sick taunt on my part. 10 out of 10 taunt. Oh, it's crit. Oh, well. Oh, frozen solid! Oh, this might be, this might be my game to win. No, this might be my game to win, boys. Oh, this is a thunder wave. This is a thunder wave, boys. This is a thunder wave. Oh my god, I'm feeling it! Guys, when you feel it, you just feel it, guys. You, when, you, when you're feeling it, you're just feeling it, man. Alright, um, he's going to liquidate here. I gotta go Shaman. I gotta go Shaman. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Least Life doesn't kill, I don't think. I don't think it kills. I don't think it kills. It doesn't kill, but I didn't do a lot of damage. I need this alive, right? But I also need this alive. So what am I gonna do? I go Moltres, of course. And I click Flamethrower. That does nothing. Absolutely nothing. If I go to this, he's gonna leech life. If I go to this, it's not gonna do enough. It's at 54 and frozen. It's at 54 and frozen. It's at 54 and it's frozen. What am I, why did I go to this? I forget. I don't know why I went to this. I don't know why I went to this. I need a leech life here. Oh, he clicked leech. It didn't work out. It didn't work out. Not according to plan. Not according to plan. All right. I need a. I need a miss here. I need him to not miss, but uh, para, para, para. All right, that's game over. Why is this team six by a rock one, dude? I'm gonna get one more because that game was stupid. I missed Mega Horn. Mega Horn actually Oko's a rock one, dude. Mega Horn actually Oko's a rock one, dude. And I don't think it was that full anyway. Ah, uh, this guy again. I'm not gonna stack Shaman this time. I'm gonna lead out with Moltres though. What did I do with Heracross? I didn't really do anything with Heracross. I need Heracross to pursue the Greeter, I think. Or just... No, Heracross died to that. If you're the real challenge, you really need to play GG. This is a solid U-turn. This is a solid U-turn. He's gonna Psychic. He's gonna Calm Mind. He's gonna Calm Mind. It's fine, you know. You get the Calm Mind going. You get the Calm Mind going. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit him with the, with the U-turn combo. The U like, that did 50%, guys. That did 50%. Ah, oh, solid. What is this? 221, 212. Oh my god. Got the solid U-turn combo going on right now. Alright, so... Oh, he's gotta go Florgus, right? He's gotta go Florgus. So if he goes Florgus... I gotta go Moltres. Moltres is the play. Oh, he goes this. Go ahead and get knocked off, son. Go ahead and get your whole life knocked. Are you serious? I needed that to hit. I can't. I can't go that. I can't. I can't go this either. Cause Destiny Bond. Moltres is the only play. Moltres is the only play viable for me at this point. At this point in the game, Moltres is the only viable Pokemon. <laughs> Are you kidding? No, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Does he not have Destiny Bond? Do you not have Destiny Bond? Solid. Solid, 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 solid. Do I go Frostlass here? Or do I go Blastoise? Or just hair cross. Hair cross is a play. What's the play here? Do I close combat? I think I close combat. I think that's a play. Ooh, give me that. 
Alright, alright, alright. This is where I go Moltres. Back to Moltres, back to Moltres. Frost Lass is in. Got a U-turn here. Got a U-turn here. There's no way you got debonded. You would have debonded. You would have debonded. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Do I Stealth Rock here? If I Stealth Rock... Let's see. Let's see how much pressure I put on this team. Let's see I go for Spike. No, he's going to kill it. If I go for Stealth Rock... I'll just pursue it here. Like he has a Florgus at 100%. He doesn't care. Right. Right. He's a he's a frost that's at one percent. Yeah, yeah. It sucks that I know his team though. Cause like if he goes straight beyond, like I'm gonna just I can just go bless this, right? Cause against this I can taunt plus toxic and that should be fine. That should be fine. Tom plus toxic should be fine. I mean, that's that's also fine. Oh, there we go. Here we go, boys. Let's let's hit him up with a knockoff. Nice, nice, nice. Now I can fire off close combats for the rest of the game. Nice, nice, nice. Cupid shuffle him on top is poisoned. Drapey off. Nice nickname. Nice nickname. Solid nickname. All right. Knockoff. Critical hit. That sucks, but whatever. Can't do anything about that. Got Earth Power here, got Earth Power. He knows that I outspeed, he already, but he already set up a Swords Dance, so I don't know. Okay, solid, 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 solid. I don't know how he deals with Moltres, to be honest. Wait, what is this? Am I not max defense? Um, I can sack Mesh Brit. Yeah. Um, if he goes to Florgus, I can set up spikes and then switch out to Moltres. This is not, you are not, you are not, nope. You are not, nope, nope. You are not. I'll set up another spike. I'll set up another spike just right in your face. Not sure if that was a play, but I did it. All right. I don't, I don't think the hit on top is going to heal up to full. It might heal a lot, but I don't think it's going to heal up to full. Oh, it doesn't even. Nice, nice, nice. So I'm going to edit it there because that's a nice win. That's a nice W. And hope you guys enjoyed the showdown live. Please leave a like and more content coming soon. Peace.